Hi, welcome to The Gamesplainer. I'm Jeff The Gamesplainer and today I'm gamesplaining the Pirates of Port Royal. In the first video I went through what all of the cards in Pirates of Port Royal do and how to use them. So now I'm going to have a playthrough uh, with three players. Player one, two and three. I will try to not remember what each person has or let that affect my decisions. So we start by taking a fresh card. Player one has the three and the four. I might try and just see if I can catch someone out. Uh, I'm going to make this guy walk the plank. So I have a look. He's got the seven, so he doesn't have to walk the plank. This one will force him to get rid of the seven, but by playing this one, which he'll do, this puts that on the bottom. So player two knows that the number seven card is on the bottom. He now goes through this pile and he'll grab that one. Uh, there wasn't too many to choose from. Um, he will play the spyglass and make this guy reveal his card to everyone. Everyone know he knows he has a hurricane now. Okay, let's keep this moving. Um, since everyone knows he has a hurricane, he might as well play it and force everyone to pass to their left. Then this player, uh, that number eight is a pretty good card to hang on to. Um, if he plays the balloons, he's going to lose this card anyway, so he might as well play it on this player. So he discards that and has to take a new card. Oh, okay, so player three has the number nine, that's the winning card, he needs to now hang on to that. Fortunately, he's picked up the safe harbor, so that plays there. Um, I think that I'll try this out on player number two, who had the one, he is now dead. We're down to just two players. Okay, that gets thrown out there. Um, so I'll play this one to challenge this player. He has the doubloon, so he's not killed. He might play the harbour on himself just to stay from attacks. Um, he's going to have to play that one. He can't attack this guy because he's protected by the harbour. Okay, I'll now play this, forcing that one to be revealed, which he has now revealed it, so he has lost. And player one wins using just the doubloon cards. Um, player one now gets one of these and we play again until someone gets three of these tokens. That is one round of Pirates of Port Royal. Um, I hope that makes sense and gives you an idea of how the game plays. So I hope this helps you get uh, Pirates of Port Royal to the table. Uh, if you have any comments or suggestions, please write them below. Subscribe to my videos. If you have any games that you wish to be gamesplained, please shoot me an email at thegamesplainer at gmail.com. Follow me on Instagram and Twitter to see what games I've been playing. And until next time, enjoy gaming.